Uni have been very kind enough to send three iPhone cases over um, for review. Uni, of course, not only do they specialise in iPhones, they have iPod touches, MacBook, laptops, netbook cases, so it's worthwhile giving them a check. All the details for these three cases are on your right hand side in the description, uh, should you wish to go and purchase one of these. And just before I start, these would actually make really cool gifts um, for the holiday season coming up. So I'm going to take each in turn and give you my views on it, what I like about them and what I don't. And I'm going to start off with the U-Suit Premium. Now this particular case is a hard shell case and it's very similar to the eye case that I done not too long ago. If you click here you can go to that particular review for the eye case. Very simple. Plastic. It's hard. Again it's a hard case. And it's got a very nice design at the back. Very nice texture. Um, this is actually pretty much engraved onto the case and they've got a Unia logo at the bottom I'm going here. to put the phone in the case and you've got pretty much access to all your controls on the left hand side you've got the top, the headphone port, the power button here and you've got access to the the head, the USB cable and the speakers as well and I guess one of the things I like about this case is if you're using a TomTom -tom car kit or any sort of car kit you're obviously going to have to take your external case off and it's very simple to take off, it's, it just pops out literally and there you go the other thing I like about this case is that it's not chunky, it's, I, I would consider it to be very tight fit, it's very, I don't know, it just doesn't make it look bulky, is what I'm trying to say. Also what I've noticed in this particular case that they've sent me is, it's actually, the case is actually quite loose. Can you hear that? That's pretty much the iPhone moving inside the case. And I'm thinking it's probably just a manufacturing error, I can't see it being across the whole um, range but as you can hear that's the iPhone actually moving inside the case which is really not a good sign um, but overall um, if you were to get it I'm pretty sure it's a manufacturing error it can't be across the board I like this case and I would actually recommend that you also get a screen protector with this particular version um, of this case I believe it retails for $40 again I, ha I don't have the full size the specs the measurements you can you can check that on the actual product page on the right hand side. Next up is the U skin, and again it's also by Unia. And I've gone through a lot of reviews, not by Unia, but other companies like Proporta. They've sent me the the, the silicone similar to the silicone sole. And if you haven't seen that review, click here. Again, I like this over the Proporta simply because it's got a much better grip at the back and I'm just going to show you so here it is this groove at the back is very unique in that when you're holding the phone you can actually feel or get a pretty much get a feel for the groove and it gives you a much better hold in your hand you've got the Unia logo here and lines or grooves as I said going through the back you've got the space for the camera and you've got your usual space for the headphones the power button it's not. It's actually blocked, but you, you still got. You can still press it from here. Likewise with the volume buttons, it's covered, but you can still press them. The vibrate and um, the sound buttons are still accessible. And at the bottom, you've got access to a USB port. Again, it's. Um, I've gone through the, quite a lot of silicone soles or silicone covers. There's no really, you know, real big difference between this and the Proporta. I do sort of edge towards this because it's got a good design at the back. So it really depends what kind of thing you like. I personally like this over the Proporta. Last but not least, I have the U pouch here, and I'm going to be honest, I'm not a big fan of this, and I'm going to show you why I'm not a fan of it. The design is really nice. I like the whole aspect that it's, it's, it's got a good, it's, the leather that they've used for this product is quite good and I like the designs in the middle here as well so it's something unique in my opinion but here's the thing, that's the thing I don't like and some of you are going to like this but I don't the thing is, it's not easy to put your phone in, you've got to put a lot of pressure in to get this phone in and worse is when you have to take it out it's even harder now you're probably saying it's not such a big deal but if you, like I do, I know you shouldn't do it but if you're driving and you want to take your phone out the last thing you want to be doing is driving 
taking this out of your pocket and then trying to fight to take this phone out. Now here's another case that I like, uh, the diesel case and I'm going to show you how easy it is to put it in here. There you go. One push inside, no external force needed and even better is, if I want to take the phone out, that's the phone out, very simple. Now this uni pouch will be good in some instances where, and this is probably where you'll agree with me or you'll probably want this one is, you've got your phone in here and if it's upside down for whatever reason, if you take it out your pocket or if you know by chance this falls out, the phone won't come out because it's actually very tight, it's a tight fit, it's airtight, so it's not going to come out anytime soon. Whereas if I've got it in this diesel case, the phone will no doubt slip out very easily, break, come out, smash or whatever. But for me, my personal needs, I think the diesel case is much more suited, suited towards me. But I know most of you will prefer the U-Pouch, simply because it's safe, that extra protection. So what I'm going to do here is, before I close this video, I'm going to give one of these cases away. All you have to do is comment, rate and subscribe. I'll choose one person, um, whatever case they commented for. And I'll also give away another case on my Twitter. If you're not already already on Twitter, join me on twitter.com slash i 6 lastwegian and I'll do a Twitter specific giveaway for the junior. So just to make things very clear, this video is for one case. At a later stage I'm going to do a Twitter specific giveaway and the other case I'm probably just going to keep. So whichever case is left out of these three I'll keep for myself. Um, and the giveaway will close in seven days and I'll leave the giveaway details at the end of this video and yeah thanks for watching if you've got one of these cases what do you think what are your views on these cases which ones do you like and pretty much do you agree with what I've said for these three cases thanks for watching cheers